I'm going to show you how to uh, check the wastegate actuator uh, if you have one that's um, operated via a vacuum and I'll just be using this very simple vacuum tester here so we'll go and find it on my car okay so we're under my car just here um, so on my particular Volvo D5 got the oil cooler oil sump and then if I just tilt camera just here dead center of the picture that is the wastegate actuator for the turbo um, as you can just see there's a black vacuum hose attached to it just there and center of the picture the black vertical thing that's the um, the actuator arm which is linked to the VNT mechanism inside the turbo so all I'm going to do is remove the um, vacuum pipe off the wastegate actuator, connect up the vacuum hose and let's see if this works. Okay, so as you can see now uh, with the clear hose, I've taken off the black vacuum hose, just used a long screwdriver and I've got the clear hose going onto it there. Now dead centre of the picture, just there, is the arm and so when I pull a vacuum I'm looking for two things, I'm looking for the vacuum gauge to hold uh, 20 inches of mercury um, and I'm also looking for that arm to move around about 20 millimetres um, at least. So. I'm just going to now start pumping up the vacuum gauge and we'll look out for that arm movement. I'll try and keep the camera still. Great, we saw the arm move there. I'm just going to release the vacuum in the gauge now and we'll watch the arm go back. Great stuff. Just do it one more time, just check the full arm travel, pumping up, as you can see the arms moving. So that shows that the wastegate actuator is working. And if I show you with the gauge, if it'll get a focus, if I pump it up, not only is the wastegate working, the, the actuator is working. You can get it up to 20, 20 inches of mercury, actually a little bit more. And then what you want to do is hold that. And as you can see, it's, um, it's holding the figure quite nicely. And um, you can hold it for, you know, if it holds that for like 30 seconds, then there's absolutely nothing wrong with the wastegate actuator um, and you can see that the arm has full travel as well so that's um, moving the the VNT mechanism inside the turbo and it really is as simple as that so if, if the arm isn't moving through other means um, then have a look at maybe a boost solenoid maybe you're losing vacuum through there or a vacuum pump uh, you're not building up vacuum but definitely get a hold of one of these testers because it just it just eliminates guesswork very very quickly and i hope you find that useful